man poured a large amount of ammonium nitrate powder into the water pipe. Then he seals the mouth with a plug. Then the pipe was inserted into the water. When the mouth of the pipe reaches the crack of the dam, the man pulled the rope. And then the ammonium nitrate was released. The ammonium nitrate meets the water. It quickly condensed into ice. And instantly the gap in the dam is firmly closed. But the ammonium ice in the water only lasts 90 seconds. So they had to use quick drying cement within 90 seconds. The other side of the dam, a 5 meter gap. Otherwise, as the water pressure on the dam continues to build up in less than 10 minutes, the dam will collapse completely. The hundreds of thousands of people in the town downstream will then be flooded. So the team took their equipment down to the chasm and then quickly put in a mixture of quick drying cement mixed with calcium carbonate to fill the cracks. At this point, the ammonium ice melts with less than a minute to go. And the last crack in the dam is out of reach of the team. The woman rushes to release the rope. The teammate uses inertia. He managed to swing through. But just as he finishes filling the crack, the rope on the winch rattled suddenly off the track. The winch can't turn. The team can only tug on the rope and climb up on their own. Who knows? As they climbed, the rope is worn out by the skin. The rope was about to break. He was told to use quick drying cement to make a step under his feet. Just as he was climbing up the steps, the rope snapped. Luckily, he survived. Then his teammate stepped on the steps. He climbed up without any problems. But by now the water level of the dam had already exceeded the alarm line. As the water level continued to rise, the dam could not withstand the enormous pressure.